Hey guys, it's Jill. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new. Welcome back to another 75 Soft Updates. I am still going strong. I'm new. I just needed to get that fatigue under control. Y'all, I still don't know what the heck all that was. I really, truly think it was emotional fatigue because of everything that was going on with my dog. I got all my results back. My doctor contacted me. Everything is fine. No one knows. I was at one point drinking Gatorade Zero because someone had mentioned maybe your electrolytes, which my doctor actually said in, you know, in his notes, like electrolytes. So he checked all that stuff. And that was all fine too. So I think that may have been just a placebo effect. I don't know. I don't know. But anyways, this was, I have now completed two full weeks of 75 soft. As I'm recording this, I'm actually two and a half weeks in and I'm feeling great. I really have my energy back. I'm excited to do my workouts again. They're giving me energy. They're giving me the endorphins. It's amazing and I'm so freaking happy to be back at this point because that was a really long month to sit there and wonder what's going on with my body. Why am I not motivated? Why can't I just get past this? Da, 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 da. And then everything just, you know, just kind of seemed to go downhill from there. But we are back feeling great. I have no absolute no doubt in my mind that we are going to complete this entire 75 soft challenge. And then um, who knows what's what's after 75 soft, but that's for we've, we've got a while to talk about that. I'll go ahead and talk about the results. I weighed in at 297.4, which is down 1.2 pounds. I am a total of 6.6 .6 pounds down in two weeks, which I'm very, very, very happy with. And then a total of 33.6 pounds total overall since weighing 331 pounds last year at my heaviest. So I'm gonna be honest, there's really not much to update you guys on. I am going to change my upload date. Instead of doing like weigh in Wednesdays and uploading on Wednesdays, I was looking at my analytics and y'all are most active on Sundays. So I'm going to change my upload date from Wednesday to Sundays and see if that helps grow my channel, see if that helps with the views because they have been sucking lately. And like the ones that have gotten the most are the ones where I was struggling. And that doesn't make me feel very good, honestly. I don't know what the future is for this channel. I am going to start uploading on Sundays at 11 o'clock. But on this Sunday, you guys are seeing this on a Wednesday. So this Sunday coming up, you guys are going to see finally, <laughs> I finally edited my 75 hardish results. So you guys will be seeing that video this Sunday. It's already scheduled, ready to go. There's, it's going up, okay? Um, it's done, uploaded. So that's coming up Sunday, but then next Sunday after that, I'm gonna upload. And we'll just see if that helps with my views because I'm not gonna lie, like it's kind of a little bit disheartening to see that people are more interested to see me when I'm failing and watch my videos when there's a title saying like I'm so over this or I'm struggling or this is this is the end or, or something alluding to the fact that I'm giving up which is to me that's just a very negative tone to this channel and I want people to watch when I'm like I want people to watch because I'm inspiring them not because people are just waiting for me to fail and it could just be the luck of the draw. It could have just been that people just more, that YouTube pushed that video or those couple of videos out more than they did others. I don't know, but according to my analytics, I have the most watch time on those videos. And I don't want this to be a negative space. I don't want this to turn into that. And I'm starting to feel that way again, 
before I made that video of like I'm taking my power back. And it has nothing to do with me wanting to give up. I'm just starting to see what is the point in this channel. Am I even inspiring people? Everything that I talk about here, TikTok has already seen. And I can do those videos. I do them every single day. I can do what I eat in a day videos. And honestly, with my vlogs and stuff, most of the stuff that I feel like I should be putting on this channel, like food, what I'm eating, stuff like that, recipes, I just put on my vlog main channel so i'm kind of starting to feel a little bit like it's kind of pointless for me to be uploading here but we'll we'll see so yeah i definitely will make my final decision come like june i'm, I'm kind of leaning towards if i'm gonna be honest and up front and straightforward with you guys i'm kind of leaning towards taking a break from this channel consistently posting on TikTok like I have been, consistently posting on Miss Green Eyes like I have been, and then taking the time and effort that I would put and that I do put into this channel into uploading another video onto my main channel. And then using this channel as a channel to come to when I have really lost a significant amount of weight and instead of chronicling my weight loss journey, I can more so talk about what I've done to conquer, heal, heal my eating disorder, heal myself, to be able to get to the point of losing a significant amount of weight. Um, so yeah, that's where, that's where my head is at right now. Like I said, I'm going to test it out for June and see maybe if I pick another day, if that will help. But if the views and the watch time and the engagement stays the way that it is, I definitely am going to take a break from this channel until I've lost like a good 60, 75 pounds. So that is the update because again there's really nothing to update y'all on because i do everything on tiktok and i know that that pisses some of y'all off but it pisses me off too because i really don't want to be on tiktok i really genuinely feel ever since tiktok has taken over like youtube it's just different it's different because even youtube is pushing shorts but yeah um it is what it is so we will see so that is going to do it for this video have an amazing day i will see y'all on sunday with my 75 hardish results and that's a really good video so you definitely want to check it out and it's not super long either it's like really short so yeah it won't take up too much of your time on sunday and then you can go watch my weekly vlog on Miss Green Eyes, because that's also going to be uploaded on Sunday, and uh, that'll be about an hour long. So yeah. <laughs> Bye guys. I will see you guys on Sunday with my 75 hardest results. Have an amazing day.